Hi guys. So, it's really late when I'm trying to film this and I'm trying not to disturb dad's monk marathon, so bear with me. Basically, day after Christmas shopping, this is what I got. If you saw the title of the video, it pretty much explained it. <laughs> so, everything that I got came out to be like 33 and change after tax. And I got a decent amount of stuff, if you've seen the thumbnail. Uh, where do I even start? I'll start with this. This is a bag that I'm going to end up using for Tiffany's birthday. Uh, I basically went to the store with her and I'm like, hey, pick a bag that could work for birthday and that's what I'll get. So she chose this one. Uh, and originally it was 97 cents, so it was under 50 cents. Can't complain. I was looking at a bigger version that was the same price, so I'm gonna go with the small one. She doesn't have that much anyway, so. Next, I have no idea how well you can see it, but this was originally 98, and it is a list pad, which I got for my mom. It has two Yetis on a bicycle, or... I don't know. I'm going to have to take it out, I think, of this packaging. So. At least there won't be a glare now. I don't think she saw this. Did you see this notepad beforehand? What? This, like, little Yeti. Did what? you see it before? You showed it to me today. No, I meant before today. No. I had seen it one other time and I'm like, okay, well, I need to get it for her, so I did. She still has the snowman, so she's probably not going to end up using that one for a little while anyway. Neither of those two were on my list. <laughs> but one item that was was some teeny tiny bows. Now, my original plan was to get at least three of these. But I managed to get the last one, and we were literally the first few people in line. There was one other person ahead of us to get into the store, so that's telling you how popular these bows are, I guess. I'll have to try and get some whenever I eventually put some more out next year, technically, for next Christmas. Next is something for Tiffany, and that is some Unicorn Dreams Bubble Bath. I've given her these before. This was the scent that she liked. It's like strawberry and kiwi. Plus apple. I forgot about the apple. But she liked the unicorn. I liked the mermaid scent better. Kiwi did not agree with me. Uh, excuse you. What do you think you're doing? Leave the bag alone. Don't just sniff it and act cute. <coughs> Next is some fizzing salts in the scent of cherry blossom. Now she said that these don't actually fizz that well, but cherry blossom is one of her favorite scents. So for 50 cents, You'll see that again later. Not for a birthday, though. <laughs> Next, for 50 cents each, I got some sheet mask. This one is vanilla latte. And then this one is mint mocha. And they look like ornaments. Those aren't for me, though. But I might share. Maybe. We'll see. Some things that weren't Christmas, but were on sale anyway, were these magnet sets. This one is all like desserts. This one is all breakfast food. And then this is 
dog related. I couldn't find any cat related, but Tiffany will get this as a gift eventually. Maybe her birthday, maybe Easter, we'll see. She was there when I got it, so it doesn't matter if she sees it in the hall. Same with this, what she's getting for her birthday. It is a two-piece bath set. It is lime scented. These were originally three bucks. I got it for a dollar fifty. I got her one and I got one for myself. But mine is strawberry. They'll say that again, probably many months from now. <laughs> and then the rest of the stuff I got to give away as gifts for some other ladies. Starting with this Honey Bell Body and Earth two-piece bath fizzer set. You have honey, vanilla, and apple and honey as the two scents. This was adorable and I almost didn't see it because it was hidden behind some other stuff. I can't have anything honey. Honey does not agree with me, but it makes for a very cute gift. Yes. Next is some body fantasies and it has the scent of Japanese cherry blossom, pink sweet pea fantasy, and twilight mist. It says it on the back, so I could easily cheat. Yeah, I got something similar to this last year, too. Nuggy, what you doing over there, girl? Nug! Nuggy, wh wh where are you going? To sniff my bath sets, I guess. Hmm. Alright. Next <laughs> is this lemon scented kit. It has a shower gel and then two things. One's a body scrub and one's a body butter. This would have been $2.50 as well. Pretty much everything else was $2.50 each. So, yeah. This one does not fit the theme as the rest of them because it's Bloomfield. Uh, I have a couple Bodycology Fuzzy Sock Sets, Dark Cherry Orchid, and Winter Coconut. Now, I actually got a Winter Coconut one from a friend, but I gave it to Mom because that's the one that she wanted. And the one that Mom got, which I ended up get getting, we switched, was the Bodycology Sugar Cookie, which, fun fact, I gave to Tiffany if you didn't see. So, this is the third one that's entered this house of the exact same scent. And the second one of the sparkling apple, which is really good. I'm actually saving my hand soap. I open up the sugar cookie one instead. And then the other scent in this one is the winter coconut, which I'm just now realizing is a duplicate scent amongst everything that I'm giving away. Mistakes might have been made. <laughs> I don't know. Two items left, and this is... I don't think it has a... I don't know what the brand is. But it's cucumber and melon. So... Hand care duo in mason jar. So like I said, this one is the melon. And then this one is vanilla coconut. I believe Mar got an apple one like this for Christmas, technically. Uh, she hasn't technically gotten it. It's gonna roll over to her birthday, but she has one of these. So that is my madness. Tiffany's madness, however, was a lot worse. I ended up with her receipt somehow, so uh, my receipt versus her receipt lengthwise is kind of insane, but mine's the short one. But she did get a lot of 50 cent stuff, so that was fun. Oh, I scared the cat. Bye.